a man, not just an honorable man in the community, an honorable man throughout the whole world, okay? He's been in the political arena for, he's been in the political arena for about 50 years. He's been, uh, he's walked with the integrity of God. Isn't that beautiful? Yeah. For a political man, for a man in the political arena, walk with the integrity for 50 years. That is tremendous, especially in the political arena. Because you have so many people in the political arena that's cheats and scams and you wonder, is anybody honest? Well, this man has shown over 50 years honesty in the political arena. Amen. And we are honored to have him here today. I'm so honored as the pastor of this church here to have him speaking at this church. Amen. One of my favorite, one of my favorite political leaders of all time here at this church, the heart of Jesus. Let's welcome and let's stand on our feet for the honorable John Conyers. The Honorable U.S. Congressman John Conyers. John, you're welcome to operate down here or in the pulpit, however you want to do it. It's, it's yours, okay? I just wanted to, the service is not turned over to you. Bless your heart. Give me a hug, man. <laughs> Great. Top of the afternoon, everybody. Good to be here. Reverend, thank you very much for uh, giving me the honor of coming before all of our people, our friends, uh, to be here uh, this sure. Sunday yes. to join with you in a, a celebration of uh, our religious beliefs, which is important. And also, how do we make things work out in the real world? And it's in this spirit uh, that I'm happy to join you and uh, talk with you a little bit about what it is that I think is important in bringing our religious beliefs and our political action into the same realm. And and the most important thing for me on my <clears throat> political to-do list is creating jobs for everybody in this country. <laughs> Number one, we have work for everybody in this country. And then number two, we're training people for work in new job technologies that are just new, are just getting started. You know, we're in a viral age now, and so it's very important that everybody join in and learn what's new as well as what's open. And so I introduced and wrote a bill. It's called HR House Resolution 1000, the full employment and balanced growth bill that we create full employment for everybody and that the government take the responsibility to help small and middle-sized businesses uh, take on more be, uh, take on more employees so that they can uh, hire more people and that we uh, furnish them uh, with the help that they need to, to uh, be able to get more product out of, out of uh, whatever industry or business uh, that they are developing. It's, a, it's an idea in which we don't leave it up uh, to uh, uh, the business uh, climate or hope that things work out right. Yes. We say that it's the government's role. Yes. The United States government should be trying to do everything they can to stimulate small and medium-sized businesses in creating uh, more employment for everybody. And they do that by uh, uh, setting up a trust fund uh, so that uh, a small business 
that needs a loan. And everywhere I go, the first thing a small businessman says is that we can't get a loan from the banks. The banks won't loan. So everyone needs to complete uh, paperwork for us, okay? So um, that's, that's government, it's required that you do that. So complete the paperwork. Um, no, so what we'll do is we'll, we'll have you come into the center and do that, and then we will uh, set you up for an interview with the employer, okay? All right, any questions about what we're gonna do? No? All right, so how about we do this, um, how about the first three rolls here? Why don't you go ahead and go towards the back and um, look at the job postings, okay? And then just come on back out, and then we're gonna we're gonna come out and um, and get you after we've looked at those, and we're gonna pre-screen you. And we'll go three rows at a time. All right? Wow. Okay? That's a right. <laughs> Thank you, and um, we'll be seeing you all in the back there. Do you have any questions for me at this time? Not right now. All right. Yes. Okay. okay, if you don't have a resume, that's all right, okay? So what we'll do is as you look at the postings, all right, we'll talk to you about your skills, okay? And then you can um, come back to our center with your resume. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Can we get one more picture? Oh, sure.